Welcome back, awesome Action Toy fans and subscribers. It is Saturday the 9th of September 2023 and I have got an awesome, awesome toy haul to share with you today. This is such a variety filled toy haul. It's uh, probably the biggest variety of stuff I've had in terms of age range, um, size, genre, etc, etc. So let's get the ball ro uh, rolling, not rolling, rolling. Ah! I got my first uh, Cosmic Legions figure. Uh, after this for a little while, this is High Warden Slog. Now, I do love the Mythic Legions. This is their sci-fi line from Four Horsemen. Does look really good. He's a nice, chunky 112 scale big boy. I am going to be looking to get some more of the Cosmic Legion stuff. Um, can't go all in, though I'd like to. I'd like to go multiple all ins because money and space. But he does look really really good next up let's go for a kid's toy fisher price <laughs> whoever i got bodhi's super spaceship during because even though that is a kid's toy i reckon that's going to work with 118 scale it might be a bit too kiddy i won't really know to open it up and have a look but it might have some potential and that was like three quid so i'm like you know three quid three pounds i will uh, purchase that let's try and do the box stuff first uh next up Let's go for Chap May, Soldier Force. I got their new mech, which looks great. Not sure about the guns and the arms, except the arms are hollow plastic inside there. Why, Chap May, why? That's something you can fix yourself. Uh, it does look pretty good. This is like the Soldier Force, Force version. I've got the uh, their new Acid versus, is it Beat? I forget. Uh, version coming out in the future, which is even better than that color scheme, but this is pretty cool as well. Let's stick that over there. Start hiding things now. Uh, box things first. Next, next, next. Let's do Mega Blocks. I got one of the older Terminator sets. This is the uh, Terminator Genesis set, the Time Machine, which again does look pretty cool. Can I stick that on top? I wonder. Yeah, not really. Sit. I'll stick it there for now. Which does look pretty cool. Comes with a mini Arnie minifigure. Next. Uh, number 57, who make the amazing 124 scale kits. I got the Armoured Puppet Sakura Edge, who I am looking forward to as well. Let's stick her on top there. In fact, let's see if I can zoom out a little bit. Can I zoom? No, it's in. Let me kind of put the camera back a little bit and maybe see if I can tilt up. See my messy desk, other bits and bobs I've got on there. Let's move that back and make a bit more space. Okay, there we go, a bit more space now. Okay, next up, boxed, uh, going back to Mega Brands, Mega Blocks. I got their Diecast, yes, they made Diecast. Diecast Halo Universe UNSC Scorpion. Basically, it's a Diecast Scorpion tank, but it's a Mega Blocks, one of the little bricks on it. Very small scale. I got, in fact, not one, I picked up two of them. So I'll put those there. Bye bye, slog. You're now hiding. Uh, next box. To watch what I go for next. B25 Acid Rain World. I love the B25 stuff. I hope they're still going and I hope they release new Acid Rain World stuff soon. I got the Sand Laurel again. In fact, I got uh, three of them because they were a pretty decent price. Let's stick that over there as well. Box stuff still. What's next? Okay. Down here, if I can reach it. Nah! So much stuff to get. If I move the camera just a little bit, so a bit more space to move. There we go. Let's go to. Oh, this one I already put there already. This one is a Fortnite semi box. It's a new. Was it Moisty Merman or whatever it was? But this is new color from It does look pretty cool. Got that the other day. He's sort of semi boxed to stick him there. Properly boxed. Yeah, I picked up, I got the new Joy Toy Frontline Chaos stuff, new sort of artwork style, this is the Vermouth Gangster, let's put her there, and also got the other gangster, who is the Bourbon, or Bourbon Gangster, let's stick him other side there, still on box stuff, Fortnite again. I got Dyer plus Wolf, which is a new set. I've got the Wolf already. I've got Dyer already. He looks like he might be a slightly different color scheme. 
Uh, but I wanted another one of him and him anyway, so I get this new box set. And it comes with articulated chicken, which is pretty cool. And it's a nice chainsaw. And those who are interested, this is Dyer. Oh, can I focus now? Let's get a focus going. Can I get a focus? There you go. Dyer 309 duo mode is what it says. So let's just stick that one over here as well. Next, oh, I've still got a couple more bits to go. Let's stick with Fortnite. New figure again. This is Sergeant Winter. It's like a, almost a Father Christmas sort of hardcore commander. It does look pretty cool. And he is Solar Mode Series 1, number 301. So stick him there. I think he can go up a little bit, perhaps. Yeah, he'll stay there nicely. Next for Boxed, Eagle Force versus Riot. I got the Nemesis Riot Saboteur, who looks absolutely fantastic. I do love the Eagle Force stuff. I just wish I had more money for more of them. Really, really cool looking figure. He can go in front of the gangsters. I think it's one more, no, a couple more box things. Next from DC Multiverse, I got another Mr. Freeze. I've got at least, I've got one I've had already reviewed, top right of the screen now, and I've got another two box, maybe three box, and I've got another one on the way who's missing the backpack, will be my next toy haul video, because he's such a great figure. Stick him, ah, can I move the Eagle Force across? And stick him sort of there. Uh, next now, so some stranger box stuff, perhaps. I've got some of these egg toy, sort of cyb cyborg, cyborg, robotic fish. The reason being, they look like the heads that Acid Rain World had in their little crossover recently. Maybe they are from the same design, but they're damn sight cheaper than buying Acid Rain World figures. Um, it's like a Luggins, a Luggins head. Very, very cool. I think I opened... Which one did I open? Was it that one? It wasn't that one. I'll find one, the one I opened and have a quick look. Was it this one? Or maybe, maybe I just imagined it. I'm sure I opened one. Let's have a look. No, that one's definitely taped. There we go, that one. Here we go. Still in the uh, plastic bag. But very, very cool. Put her up. That way up. Looking sort of a robot fish. Which you could use as a head if you make the uh, neck socket. So we've got a full set of four of those. I think it's one more boxed. Uh, well, it's bagged, I should say. I got here a complete set of, I'm gonna call it a scaffolding. But it also comes allowed, you can make a little platform for your 118 scale or 124 scale or whatever action figures. Very, very cool. Get an idea in that sort of black and white picture there. That can go up there. And then loose stuff. Uh, let's go Fortnite first. I got another two Moth Mandu, who's got one of my favourite head sculpts ever on 18 scale. I've actually got another one, or is it another two? I think it's another one on the way, which means I'll have, um, one, I think, four in total now. Pretty, pretty cool. So happy with that. Still with Fortnite. Uh, this is a new one. I don't know his name, so someone can drop, drop a comment and tell me his name. See the body before, but the head sculpt is new. Loving the head sculpt, very creepy, very, very cool. Let's stick him there. Um, two more bits, I think. Next, I got this like a Schleck ripoff crab. Rawr. Warrior monster crab, it's pretty cool. And then lastly, now where am I gonna put this? I have no idea. Uh, Global Forces, I believe is the brand name. I reviewed their tank and their, well, two of their tank style things before and the scaffolding they do. The scaffolding is amazing. I got their helicopter here they do, which is pretty cool. Again, no idea where that's going to go. Uh, <laughs> no, if I move this over here, put the helicopter sort of there, put that on top and getting sort of a, an idea. And if you want to see what the scaffolding sort of thing looks like that comes with the box sets, this is a built version of one. You can all put it together and whatnot. It's very, very cool. It's articulated too. So it looks like that. Um, I think that's everything at all. Did I forget anything? In case I've moved something. All right, I think that is it. I do have a couple more bits coming, but I'll save those for the next toy haul. 
which will be uh, a bit later on. So that's my toy haul. I hope you enjoyed that. Uh, please subscribe to the channel to see all the videos. Uh, if you want to see everything early, then please join up the Patreon. It's free for seven days, so you can cancel any time in those seven days. In those seven days, you can watch all the videos because they're always put there first before they're published on YouTube. Link in the top right of the screen now, so it is worth checking out. If you go to the video description, there are discount codes and links for some of the better 118 scale and other scale toy sellers. So it's worth checking that out too so you can get yourself a bargain. I will see you in the next video. Stay happy, keep collecting. Bye-bye.